as my name is iPhone Get Stuff, and I'm here bringing you another iOS video. And in this video, I am I'm going to be showing you a bit more about the Heyday app. And without further ado, let's get into the app and show you what it's all about. Hey guys, I'm back, and I'm here in the Heyday app, and I am still at the Halloween update. Nothing's changed, and yeah. So it's just loading up right here. It won't take that long. And I'm really excited to make this video right here because um Hades probably one of my main apps that I use. And I really, really like it. It's really fun. It's a great app. Oh, and it might look a bit glitchy. Sorry about that guys. Because um I don't know why, it's just a huge app. So with the reflector program that I use, it glitches out a little bit and delays. So, um, yeah. Sorry about that, guys. Whoa. It's really glitching right now. I really want to fix this. I think it's probably because I haven't purchased the Reflector yet, because I'm just using the 10-minute trial still. So, um, once I purchase it, it'll probably be much better, but right now it's kind of laggy. But it's working a little bit. So pretty much what Heyday is, is it's a farm-based game where pretty much what you do is you start off with nothing, like most of these games, and then you have to build up to have this. You get levels from XP. You get XP from farming, from doing lots of stuff, from selling stuff. See here, this is this guy. His name is Greg. And he wants some bacon for 88 bucks. And I'm like, yeah, totally. So I say, here you go. And I give him the bacon, he does a little dance. Here's this guy. I don't know his name, I just call him the fat man. He moves his eyebrows and humps. Just gonna tell you that. So yeah, he wants seven apples for 215 bucks, and I'm like, sure. So I'll sell it to him, he'll do a little dance too, and then he'll leave. Completely forgetting about his dance. Whoa, lag much. So then another thing you can, so then there's lots of things. And then here, there's another way, place where you can sell. And what you do is right here. You can it's a roadside shop, and um, so you can pick what you want to sell. So I'm going to sell some bacon, and then you can advertise it in the newspaper. See, I'm just going to unclick that, and then click it again because I want an advertisement. You get an advertisement in the newspaper. So if someone's looking for bacon, they go in the newspaper. They're like, "Hey, look, this guy's selling bacon." And you get to pick whatever price you want, but eventually, see, I'm just moving the price up. But eventually, it will stop you, and because you don't like, because some people are just gonna sell like one piece of wheat for like a thousand bucks, and that's just stupid. They don't want people being fooled by that. So this is the max price. I like to put it a few things lower than max price because I think that really works. That's what most of my friends do too. So yeah, and then I can just click put on sale. And there. So yeah, this is Greg's. You can visit your friends. For some reason Greg is automatically put as my friend. See, this is what it looks like to other people. So then here he's selling some TNT. And TNT is amazing. When you first start off in this game, do not sell your TNT. Because people will buy it. And then you'll never have it again. And then you'll have all this random rocks on your property that you won't be able to explode. So do not sell your TNT. You want to buy TNT. And he's also selling some, um, some, um, sorry, some, um, <laughs> so bad, pineapples and, sorry, not pineapples, pumpkins. Oh my god. Just so bad today. Oh god. Sorry guys. Just have to fix this. Hey guys, I'm back. Uh, yeah, my game just glitched, and it was actually pretty lucky because the uh, my 10 minutes just went up, so I had to I had to do something with the program to get it back. So I was pretty lucky because the the uh, reflector just crashed too. So at least we didn't have double at the same time. So yeah, I guess I guess it's a win-win situation. So um, another thing you can do is that every day you'll see this little wheel of fortune or fortune. I like to say fortune because it sounds funny. And then what you do is you spin it, and then it will land on something. 
and oh it landed on it landed on spin again thanks I don't know why they made a spin again I find it just a waste of my time so I'm just gonna say to Supercell get rid of the spin again so Supercell is the people who make this so then I want I want a shirt that's cool so yeah a lot another thing you can do is you can make popcorn in this game once you get a popcorn maker and popcorn sells very well especially buttered popcorn which is the exact same thing but you just add butter so there and it gave me a bit of XP and now another thing is that there's pumpkin pie it, you can make a knitted pie oven and this month right now there is a global event going on sorry a personal event like a global event thing where what you have to do is you can add is there's always one going on it used to be eggs and bacon bacon and eggs and now it's pumpkin pie because it's Halloween so um you can put pumpkin pie right there you can contribute it and it'll give you some money some XP and then if you reach your personal goals then you you can be put in this list and the reward is going to be is well for last for the last one was five diamonds and diamonds are amazing in this game so yeah if you ever see one of those definitely participate in it it's so worth it so here I'm just collecting some some butter so yeah this is pretty much how this game works I really really recommend it and yeah so um I'll see you right at my home screen see you guys Hey guys, I'm back, and um, actually my little sister just told me something really funny, because she was reminding me of the, uh, when I said pineapple instead of pumpkin, because she's right next to me, and um, then she told me that she's fighting a giant mutant pineapple in the game she's playing, so yeah, I just decided to tell you that, because it's kind of funny. Well, anyway, so I'm here, I got my iPhone get stuff text right here, and I really hope you guys enjoyed this video, rate, comment, subscribe. Tell me what you need me to do for my next video, because, like, right now, I'm just coming up with my ideas on my own. So I really need you guys. I need your love. I need your time. When everything's wrong, you make it right. Well, anyways, done with the quoting. Why do I always do that at the end of my videos? Well, anyways, hope you enjoyed this video. Rate, comment, subscribe. Have a nice day. Tell me what you want me for the next.